In this video, we'll find the oxidation numbers for each element in AlPO4, that's aluminum phosphate. So overall, this is a neutral compound. There's no plus or minus like you'd see on an ion. In a neutral compound, all the oxidation numbers add up to zero. So that's gonna help us. Next, on our list, aluminum isn't listed here. We normally think it has a three plus charge, so the oxidation number would be the, the plus three here. But let's look up the phosphate, PO4. That's a polyatomic ion, and you should have memorized that it has an overall charge of three minus. And in the ions, like a PO4, three minus, the oxidation numbers add up the charge on the ion. So this whole thing here would be minus three. So the aluminum, that would have to be plus three for it to be a neutral compound, for everything to add up to zero. So I'm comfortable that the aluminum is plus three. Let's get rid of this and figure out the oxidation numbers for the phosphorus and the oxygen here in aluminum phosphate. So we have aluminum, that's plus three. Phosphorus, not on our list, let's just call that X. And oxygen, almost always, with just a few exceptions, that's gonna be minus two. So now, since everything's gonna add up to zero, we just need to set up an equation and do a little math. We have one aluminum, and each aluminum is plus three, we have one phosphorus, but we don't know what that is. We're going to call it X. Plus, we have four oxygen atoms, and each one is minus two. So we'll put minus two there. And again, that all adds up to zero. So now we just figure it out. Three plus X plus that negative eight equals zero. So if we solve for X, that'll equal five. It'll be positive five. So the oxidation number on the phosphorus in this AlPO4, that should be plus five. And those are the oxidation numbers in AlPO4, aluminum phosphate. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.